All right, today we'll be showcasing and benchmarking our 2013 video editing and video gaming setup. That's the computer itself. It has an AMD FX 3.1 GHz 8 core processor. That's the Sentry 2 touchscreen fan controller which controls all four LED fans and system blower inside the computer case. And AMD Radeon HD 7770 video card is the gigahertz edition with 2 GB of GDDR5 memory. Comes overclocked from the factory. It has 8 GB of AMD Entertainment RAM memory, 2 solid state drives, one is 120 GB and the other one is 60 GB from OCC. It also has a Blu-ray Drive R. The main monitor here is a Samsung 27 inch LED backlit LCD. And now the 5.1 surround sound. That, uh, those two are the center speakers. In here that's the subwoofer. The subwoofer right there. Now the back speakers are located in the X Shocker seat along with another subwoofer speaker right there on the side you see the stereo back speakers the front speakers between the two Samsung monitors that's the right speaker on the right and we also have the left speaker between the other two monitors overall it's a 5.1 surround sound system that's pretty good for video games And now that's the Logisys illuminated keyboard and the NZXT Avatar S gaming mouse in white. Linus. This is the other Samsung monitor that I use. And this is the Avatar PC from uh, Via. Is the uh, runs on Android OS. I use it as a digital picture frame, but I can also check my uh, email on it. It runs YouTube, all of that, and also you can install Linux on it and check the web. It plays Flash, YouTube, and it's connected to the small monitor. And the fact that it runs Linux, I think, is pretty cool. Now uh, a look at our video editing environment. As you see we use the two Samsung screens. This screen right here, we're gonna rotate it. It's used only for the video preview. Everything we do in the timeline can be displayed here as the final product, as you will see it in, in a YouTube video. You can see the Toshiba 1 terabyte external USB 3 uh, hard drive right there. Windows 8 Ultimate. monitor the video preview monitor basically it's connected to StarTex uh, TV jockey which uh, allows for video input in this case a uh, cable so we can watch TV on this screen just by uh, switching to the VGA input so we press this key again and we are back to computer monitor mode and or video editing environment.
now let's play a game. We have ACR, Auto Club Revolution. Okay, let's choose our car. Um, let's see, the Mazda RX-7. Okay, now it's time to benchmark the computer with the Heaven DirectX 11 benchmarking tool. The benchmark in full HD quality gives us a score of 1,082 
average frames per second 43 minimum frames per second 24.1 maximum 83 everything's on high direct 3d uh, 11 direct direct x11 uh, full screen and yeah I think it's, it's pretty good now let's check the Windows Experience Index right the base score is 7.4 okay the processor has a score of 7.5 the RAM memory has a score of 7.6 the video card and the desktop graphics have a score of 7.4 as the video card and the memory the solid state drive has a score of 7.8 all right so that is our video editing and gaming rig setup peace